What do you think is better, smoking or dabbing? Let's ignore the obvious, por que no las dos? We can get both, all that. Let's ignore and really decide what you think is better. Like if you could only do one for the rest of your life, which one are you choosing, smoking or dabbing and why? I feel like for me, I kind of lean more towards dabbing, but there are certain times of the year where I just flat out smoke more than I dab. I think the end of last year, on my Twitch stream specifically, I was hitting the bong 10 times or so in a stream and I would really only do a few dabs and part of that is because i do mostly a just chatting stream and it's easier to keep the conversation and the flow of things going when you do a quicker hit a bong rip takes like 10 to 15 seconds if you do one and a dab takes like a minute or so there's just more time that you're creating vapor versus when you just do a nice quick combustion hit i do think this answer shifts for me but i i lean towards dabbing more often i do think dabbing is ultimately better there was a time after i moved to colorado where i switched to dabbing for like a year. I started getting into more different types of concentrates, getting into different types of rigs and trying out different things. And I just flat out shifted away from smoking. And I was like, bro, dabbing's the future. All I ever want to do is dab. If you go a long time without smoking a bong and then you smoke one, <laughs> I don't care who you are. It gets you high. It gets you really, really high. I'm actually looking forward to doing this again because I haven't smoked a single bong. I haven't smoked a single bit of flour this year. At the end of last year, I was a little bit sick. I had a cold and whatnot. And then I, I was really just dabbing. I wasn't dabbing that often because I was sick, but I kind of ran out of flour and just bought a bunch of dabs. And ever since the beginning of the year, I've only dabbed. I haven't smoked any flour, but I'm planning on doing it soon. And I know that I'm going to get really, really high just because I haven't had that combustion in a while. Some of the main reasons that I think dabbing is better or why I, I kind of gravitate towards dabbing more often is because it's just flat out cleaner. It's cleaner on your body, essentially. They've extract, extracted all of the essential oils from the plant. You're just getting the cannabinoids and the terpenes if it's done through a proper extraction. And they've eliminated all the bad parts of the plants, all those carcinogens that you're trying to avoid when you use an herb vaporizer. Wax is just basically eliminated all that you don't have any other parts that you don't want you might have a little a little butane left over or something depending on the type of extraction or even like hash rosin where it's sawmillist you might have a little bit of plant particles in there or whatever it's not necessarily uh the cleanest always like on your piece right dabs are typically cleaner but i've noticed like some flower rosin and hash rosin can be a little bit dirtier on your nail but flour is just generally dirtier on your piece right smoking is dirtier than vaping or dabbing right dabbing is vaping if you're doing it right there are some people out here doing glowies and combusting their wax and they're essentially smoking the oil instead of vaping it. But if you're doing it properly, dabbing is cleaner. Think about a bong right now. Run 10, 20 hits through it. What's it look like? It's not going to be as clean as a dab rig, even if you run 40 or 50 hits through it, right? There are people that do huge dabs at low temps and they pull really hard and you end up with a lot of reclaim, essentially melted wax sometimes just getting sucked straight into your piece. There are cases of that, but overall... What smoke leaves behind isn't as clean as what the vapor leaves behind. Especially from a smell perspective, you do a few bong rips in your room. Somebody's going to know if they walk in several hours later that you did bong rips in there. You did dabs, they might not notice as much because the smell doesn't linger as much and it doesn't have that same smell because it's vapor versus combusted flowers. I will say I do think the highs are different. You can get really high in a certain way from them. You can get really high in a certain way from smoking. And I don't think that they're the same. I, I think it's hard to compare which high is better overall because there are sometimes I just prefer the smoking high over the dabbing high. Or sometimes I feel like after a long session of dabbing, I just need that one bong rip to seal the deal or finish it off. And if you want to hear more on the topic of dabbing, check out my future of dabbing video. I break down a lot of the things I think are going to go down in the future on dabbing.